we found the gravestone because we heard the rumour that she was buried yes, in the garden. Yes, true. Um, it is true, she's <laughs> yeah. there. Yeah, we found it. Today we are exploring this abandoned time capsule which has a very sad story. I cannot believe the power is still turned on here. Look at the mould on this. Now this looks very expensive. This is absolutely incredible. I think we may have just found her grave. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to today's video. Now today as you can see I'm joined with Ben from Lost Adventures and today we've come to check out a house which was given to me by one of my subscribers who's a neighbour in this area and they've told me that the, the lady who actually used to live here is buried in the garden here. Now we, we've yet to find it, we've literally just got here and I've got to say the place is so overgrown it was very difficult to get in here. Nobody's been in here for years. Let's go and check it out and see what we can find. Okay, so we've literally just got here. Ben's just setting up his camera to do a few bits. Now the gate is completely overgrown. Like nobody has been through there for a long time. The public footpath gate is even worse. So trust me, this place hasn't been lived in for many, many years. Now we've got a garage here, which looks quite interesting. I think we'll have a quick peek inside while we're here just to see if there's an old car or something interesting in there. Oh, it's quite difficult to get to. Um, so the answer is no, there is a lot of furniture being stored in there and it looks like it's been there for a very, very long time too. Oh, as well as all of the stuff out here as well. God, this place is so overgrown. It really is. Now the house, look at that, you can barely see the house. You, you can't see it from the road, it's that overgrown. It really is that overgrown. But look at this guys, look how derelict it is. Wow. Do you know what, I, I go to say that this place has been abandoned for at least 10, maybe 15 years, maybe more. That is absolutely incredible. Let's take a little walk up here. We've got a few broken windows around the side. We've got a, a dog's toy by the look of it. <laughs> just down there but look at this look at the cobwebs on the inside look at all of the stuff in there look there's an old cactus plant there do you know what i think this is going to be a really really good place now we've got a main road just over there that you can see the main gate where the people used to come through is just non-existent absolutely non-existent look at the window frame okay so what we're going to do we're going to have a little walk around the outside now i have been told that the lady who used to live here is actually buried in the grounds here somewhere now i, I don't know anything about the laws in the uk of how you're allowed to do that but i was told that she's definitely buried here 100 percent i mean it's very very creepy but it's also very sad you know especially if there's nobody here now let's go see if we can find it let's have a look around so we've got the main entrance which was just there I can't see anything there at all. Nothing. Look, we've actually got people walking past at the moment. It's so overgrown, they can't even see us. And we're only, what, 15 feet away, 20 feet away? They don't even know we're in here. see the house is completely invisible from the outside. Now, I don't think there's anything around this area. So we're going to have a little walk around the side and see if we can find anything around here. There's a big mound there, look. 
looks interesting but not really an official grave as such I can't see any tombstones or anything yet what's that there what's that there Ben come look at this I think this could be something yeah i really don't know this this definitely doesn't look right like the way that's been organized to me it looks like potentially there could be maybe one there or one there well, i reckon she's buried over here mate you reckon there's too many signs and clues look what's that there i don't know what that's that a cat in it it's a cat <laughs> it's a cat what what it's probably an ornament on the end of that grave do you think Mate, you're right, you're right, you're right. I think we found it, guys. I think this is it. Is this it? Mate, here we go. This is it. This this is it, 100%. Yeah, yeah, 100%. She's under there. That's the headstone, isn't it? Yeah. This might have been flattened. Okay, we found it. That's yeah, that's of part of it, 100%. <sighs> oh my. I don't believe this. this Do you know what? I thought the story was a little bit unusual. Mm. But that to me looks like a headstone. It's stuck in my hands. <laughs> okay, guys, so I think what we have found here is the grave. So we've got the stone there. We've got the cat, which would have been put at the bottom, and they've put this over the top of it to kind of mark where it is. Now, it must have been an official burial. I mean, I don't know too much about this, do you? I don't know what kind of laws and things you have to go through to bury someone in a house, but... Someone that's got their partner buried in the garden. Though. Yeah. So I think, without a shadow of a doubt, 100% this is her grave here. <sighs> okay, well, there's a first for everything. That is the first time I have ever found a grave with someone at a domestic property. Mm -hmm. I just don't know what to say. Well, I think what we're going to do is take some pictures quick and then we're going to jump inside and have a look at the house. There's a body buried. <sighs> the Italian woman is buried down under that cat. Okay, that is creepy. <laughs> right, on that note, guys, um, let's go and find a way into this house because I don't want to have nightmares tonight. Ah, there's a door here. Let's go and have a look inside. Okay, guys, we are now in this house and I cannot believe the amount of stuff that's been left in here. And I can't actually believe, by the sound of it, it sounds like the power is still on. Something ticking away over here. You guys can hear that. That's absolutely crazy. Like this, like this, this place is completely overgrown. Like completely overgrown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody has been in here for a long, long time. Look at that. Oh, it stinks in there. Yeah, it does. Yeah, worse than it. <laughs> oh, don't. God, all the cupboards are still filled up. Ben, look at the dates. 2000. 2000. 23 years oh ago. Oh my now. god, that is 23 years ago. That's it. Yeah, I know, mate. A bit of a mess. Do I, um. <laughs> Do I? What? Man, this me like a motherfucking skunk <laughs> shit. Oh, that is absolutely disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> right. Let's move on. Hang on a minute. If that's still on, surely there's power in here. Try Where's it. the light switch? Light here. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh my God, okay. There go. That's, that's ridiculous. Oh, I'm guessing we've got to go through here. 
Oh my god. Look at this. Light switch, do you reckon? <gasps> oh mate, this is incredible. Look at the spider webs everywhere. Look, there's literally spider webs everywhere. How is this even possible? Look at the amount of stuff in here. Oh, do you know what? I cannot believe how many spider webs are here. I'm literally walking through spider webs as I... Oh, it's gone in my eye, that one. <laughs> Look. Look, all the power still onto the clocks as well. What's that noise? The radio's on. Hang on. Ah! <gasps> I don't believe this. Can you believe this? How how does this even happen? I wonder if the TV works. How'd you turn it on? Oh my god. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Honestly. Twenty three years and it's still No one's been in it in Wow. Do you know I believe it as well? The the house is so overgrown outside and the yeah. the fact that we're walking through all these spider webs. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, well this is literally the first room, so um let's have a look through here. Oh I don't believe it. The the light is on in here too. This house is completely invisible from the outside world. Like the main gate to get into this house is is so overgrown. I mean, I ripped my trousers getting in here. It's it's that bad. Oh, wow. Look at the stuff in here. Oh my God, I just cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Look at the mold on that picture. There is decay everywhere. And I mean everywhere. Look at the spider webs in here. This is absolutely unbelievable. Wow, this is really, really old too. Look at this. Look at the suitcases. And guys, look at this. I'm going to have to turn the light off so I can show you this so you don't get the reflection on the window. But just look how derelict this place actually is. Honestly, this is just... One of those places that's been locked away for so long that nobody knows about. The power has been left on. How the bills are getting paid, I can only assume that the money that was left in the bank account is paying the bills still. I mean, there's no other logical explanation how this can happen. Look at the mould on that suitcase. Honestly, this is absolutely remarkable. Wow, look at the mould on that too. Okay, this is um, this is one of those really, really special ones that just blows me away. Absolutely blows me away. This stuff is so old. There is dust over everything. Oh, just look. Honestly, I cannot believe it. And this is only the second room. Okay, let's um, go and check out here next. So this door looks like it's actually locked, but there is a light on inside. So maybe it links up with this one here. Look at that, more suitcases. Oh wow, look, there's a, a wing mirror there from something. It's broken. Is it gonna fall off if I pick it up? Do you know what? I think that's off a metro. I could be wrong, but I think that's a metro wing mirror. God, I cannot look how dirty my hands are. Wow, I might have to get my other torch on that because um, it's quite difficult to see. There is so much stuff in here, it's ridiculous. Okay, let's shut that back up. Oh wow, look at these books. Look how old those books are. I don't know if I can take one out of there. I 
don't want to damage them. No, they're all quite tight. They've probably swollen up. I'm going to leave those in there because I don't want to ruin them at all. Okay, so I think I'm going to have a look in here now. This is the bathroom. This is the main bathroom. Guys, look at this. This hasn't been used in decades. Oh, the spider webs. Honestly, the spider webs that I'm walking through just to get in here. Just goes to show how long this has been left for. Look at this. Crest toothpaste. Who remembers that? Look, it's brand new. It's never been opened. There's no date on there at all. 9021. That's not the date. I don't think there is. No, there's not. Oh, it's disgusting. Mate, this is unreal, isn't it? It's amazing. Look, look at the bath. That bath hasn't been used in such a long time. Look, there's a pair of dirty socks hanging on the side there. And there's another pair of dirty socks in the bottom of the bath. <laughs> oh, no. All these clothes yeah. hanging out to dry. This is disgusting. Is that knickers? Maybe? I think it is, yeah. I think they're knickers. Wow. How is this even possible that this place has been left for this long? Whoop, nearly. <laughs> oh, it stinks in there. Family talc. Yeah. Covered in dust, look. Look, and this is Italian. Oh, wow. So look at these toilet rolls, look. Never used, but look how delicate they are. Mm. Look, you wouldn't be able to do anything with that. Oh, that's true. They're so fragile. <laughs> okay, I think it's time to uh, look upstairs now, guys. So we're going to go and have a look upstairs and see what we can find up there. Okay, guys, so we're going to take a look upstairs now. Now, I must admit, I am absolutely petrified walking around here. I am walking through spider webs, which tells me nobody has been up here for a very very long time can you see the spider webs in here ben yes. they're literally <laughs> everywhere no i don't know what that is that's weird isn't it how strange oh. what the what the <laughs> oh. Okay, we've got a dining table up here with oh. a light on. Ben, nobody's been in here for decades and I'm walking through spider webs. Really? But the light's on. What? Look, there is spider webs. I don't know if you can see it with Ben's light on me. All over my face. I am literally walking through spider webs like you wouldn't believe it. But you walk in here and the light's on. This is weird. This is a true time capsule. As true as they come and as honest as they come. God, I, I don't know what to say about this. This is really strange. Like, really strange. Look, all the wardrobes have still got clothes in. I'm going to have a look inside this and see what we can find. Oh, wow, look at that. Ben, look at that rat. <laughs> Look at the rat. No way. Is that real fur? It is, isn't it? It is. Oh my god. It's made of real rats. Oh, can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Look at the stuff in here. This is amazing. That feels like bone china. It's really, really lovely. Look at this one here. This looks even older. Oh, it's got a, a butterfly on the bottom and it's all marked as well. God, that is really, really light. That one's got a bit of a crack in the bottom of it. It just goes to show the age of it. Wow. Yeah, that looks like gold. What is that? Oh, it's got... No, I know what that is. I know exactly what that is. That's one of those. 
So it must have been like a, a second order of placement, maybe. Wow, that was so cool. Let's shut this back up again. Make sure they go back together properly. Yeah, I'll just... <sighs> yeah, I know, they're literally everywhere. But what is that all about? Two doors? <laughs> it's very it's bizarre. Okay. It's you, you knocked the chair when you walked over there. What's that corner bit? Is that, is that a... Is that like a church bench seat or something there? It's unusual, isn't it? Yeah. Look at the cobwebs, though. Yeah. Oh, my goodness me. To my wife. Yeah, I've just noticed that card up there. To my wife. Oh, my God. I don't know if I want to touch it. Cause I don't know, it's been there for so long. I don't want to, don't want to move it. Okay, well, we've got another three rooms up here to look in. Um, oh God, I'm actually quite scared to go in there. I know. Oh, the lights come on. Do you know, this is one of those places where you're worried that you're gonna find something. Okay, well, this is an empty room. There's, there's, well, I say empty, there's nobody in here. Um, what's that a firework? Oh no, look at that, it's a, a packet of fruit pastels, which is actually like melted onto the top. That is ridiculous. Data recording stains. What on earth is that? Oh, it looks like they were using it as a, as a bin of some sort. Data recording, that's very interesting. Look at the decay on these walls and the ceiling as well. <sighs> Ben's running away because he's too scared to look in the other rooms. <laughs> oh wow, I'm gonna turn that light back off there guys, just so you know, shut the door back up. And I'm gonna do the same with this one here. Even though the light was turned on, I think it's safer to turn the light off just to stop a potential fire hazard. I'm gonna shut this door back up. Now, why has this door been secured like that? That was creepy, wasn't it? I think it's just the wind moving. But why? Why has that been done? Could be a trap, mate. You don't know what's going to happen with that. Could be a gun pointing at the keyhole. Oh. <laughs> after, after you, mate. <laughs> after you. Right, if I tell you what, if I stand here and I push it open, yeah. and then you can see. Oh. Uh, there's no gun there. But there is another light on. I don't understand this whatsoever. I really don't. Again, guys, look, we've got spider webs as we go into the room which shows that nobody has been in here for an extremely long time. God, look at the rat poo all over the carpet. Ooh, Maybe that's why they, um, as well the have they? Mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe that's why they um, pulled the door shut like that. <laughs> oh, look at that. It looks like we've got a potential water leak. Do you know what? I can't believe how many spiderwebs I'm walking through right now. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera, but they are all over my face, literally all over my face. They're everywhere. If you look at the ceilings, just look how many spider webs are around this room. This is so bizarre, isn't it? Oh, I've just walked in a massive one there. That's quite a strange bit of work. Look at that little baby in a rucksack. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's dated 1969. And it's signed by Louis Roland. That's an original there. Looks like it. Very strange, mate. It really is. Okay, well, there is one more room to look in up here. And look at this, how the wallpaper has actually fallen above the door. Which just goes to show how long this door hasn't been open before. 
I am absolutely terrified to look in there. Okay, this looks like just a little storage room. Wow. Oh, it's a little computer room. Oh, wow, it looks like it was a little secret office, maybe. Wow. Look at that old screen. Oh my goodness me, this is so old. Old IBM keyboard. Look at the hard drives, these are ancient. Wow, this is remarkable. Okay guys, so before we go back downstairs, Ben's decided he wants to have a quick look in the loft. So, would you like to do the honours? Okay. Are you scared? Yeah. I don't think there's going to be anything nasty out there. Oh! Alright, I thought it was going to lift up one way, but the whole thing's going to come off. Oh, mate. Could be a body up there. Oh, no. Hang on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right, what I'm going to do is stick my camera up because that's one way to have a look. Yeah, that's a good shout. Small. Yeah. Really small up there. It is, isn't it? Oh, there's a black bag. Can you see that? Oh, what? Oh. What's all that? That's where she's buried, mate. Don't. What the hell? Oh, mate, can you imagine if you actually saw something like that? You'd have to just find a place, wouldn't we? Yeah. What is that? I don't know. I think it's just so... Like... Oh, look out! <laughs> Bedding, what's that, I reckon? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a bee or... <laughs> oh. oh, mate. What about around the back side? I reckon there's nothing out there. No, I'll stick mine out there quick and have a look. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're going to have a quick look in the loft before we... Uh, leave i'm gonna put my light on brightest setting so we can see what's up here oh something in that bag oh don't there's nothing there it's quite small yeah it's do you know what it's a very small loft isn't it it's quite a small house somehow yeah yeah the outside hang on let me try and swing the camera around that way can we see anything? No, I don't think there's anything. Oh, camera's going blurry. Hang on, let's focus. Focus, Mr. Camera. There we go. Make sure we don't miss anything. Okay, so we know what's in the loft now. There's no bodies out there, which is good. Great, right, we're gonna pull this back. There we go. Locking back up again. As we found it, because that's what we do, guys. We always leave places how we find them. Okay, well, that was quite scary, wasn't it? Mm, mm. <laughs> you never know what you're going to find. No, I know, you, know you don't, I, mean, I know you don't. It's not like anybody else has been in here and took a photo yeah. for us to have a look at. This is still weird, this door here. I can't understand why you would put two doors there. Mm. Very bizarre. They have that in like real old manor houses, like quite yeah. expensive mansions and stuff. That's right, they do. But in a tiny little house like this, it is weird. And yeah. plus, what, is, what was that meant to do? I don't know. I really don't know. Was that tied around then? Yeah, it was bad, basically as it is, just, just hooked behind it. It's really strange. So, um, yeah. Guys, we we may never know. <laughs> it's one of those mysteries where mm. we will never know. Um, maybe we'll ask a neighbour. If we can see a neighbour, we might ask them and see if we can yeah. find any, any history on it. Yeah. But we're going to run around, do some pictures, doing Instagram stories and a TikTok video, and we'll see you back outside in a minute. And apparently somebody said he had a Pakistan wife or something. She died and she's buried in there somewhere. She is, we've just seen it. Oh yeah? Yeah, we've just seen the grave. What's it like just, in there? It's amazing. Yeah. It's a time capsule, like yeah. everything still works in there. All the lights turn on. Have you been on in there? Yeah, yeah. So you as yourself? Well, just these lads have been in there. Jesus Christ. Honestly, it's yeah. amazing. It's scary. It's not, it's, it's surprisingly. It's ghost and all sorts in there. It's still on, and they turned the telly on in there. Yeah, the, the power's still on. Did you Honestly, the half, the half the building's falling down on the left side. You can go in, you go in the rooms, all the lights still turn on, the TV's turn on. Every fox in the, in the neighborhood yeah. is living yeah. in there. Yeah. And we found the gravestone, because we heard the rumor that she was buried yes, in the garden. That's true. And it is true, she's yeah. there. Yeah, we found it. He had a yellow van, didn't he, or something? Yellow. I've got a clue of this fella. Yeah. 
he knows he knows an awful lot about it. Oh, does he? Went over there because he said to me that it was her wish to be buried in that ground. Wow. And he brought her back. So she died in Italy, but they brought her body back here and buried he, her in the he garden. He went for it, and and he I got it. He, he, there's somewhere in this line. I don't. I can't. An undertaker was involved. Yeah. Because. We watched what was going on. Wow. There was a couple of blokes a bit bigger than you. Yeah. Turned up one day, went in there, switch with shovels, oh. spades, and dug a grave. Wow. You could write a book the about next, this, couldn't you? The yeah. next, next day, the hearse turned up. Wow. Got a, got a hearse, and all the people, the, the paper, and uh, he. he he assured me that everything, all the paperwork had been done. And yeah. The frame. He was there. They opened the gates, carried it in. Oh my yeah, goodness! Shut me. the gates, and the two big lads had the spades still, and the, uh, they, uh, they blocked anybody trying to get in. Wow! The police had got been there. Yeah. Gone in. You found him dead in bed. Oh no! End of my worst story. Wow. Okay, guys, we are back in the car and we have just had, <laughs> I can't quite believe it, the conversation with the local neighbours. Now, it's true. The rumours are true. She is absolutely 100% buried there. But more interestingly, the guy who used to live there has another house not far from where we are. And apparently he passed away in this house and it is pretty much identical to the one we've just been in. So what me and Ben are going to do, we're going to do a little bit of research, a little bit of digging. We're going to find out where this house is. We're going to go there and film the whole thing for you. But bear in mind, he did die here. Now, apparently he died upstairs and he wasn't found for a long time. So I think it is going to be a little bit grim in there, but it should be a good, good explore. So <laughs> stay tuned for that. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe. Please go and check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explorer underscore. Also go and check out the Facebook page. Like always, I put all the pictures on Facebook, 10 of this from Instagram. I will link Ben from Lost Adventures in the description below, and we'll see you on next week's video.